Hey folks, going to do just a little bit of a review here. Uh, we seem to be getting a lot of new folks interested in Earth's catastrophe cycle, and while there are many moving pieces to it, I want to go over the part of it that is the most certain, something that we are more than 99% on. No scientist likes to say 100%. Um, about as close as we could possibly be on this one. Several of the other aspects of the disaster cycle are above 90%, above 80%, but here is the baseline most important information. And by the way, if you have not watched this video, it lays out nearly the entire story in less than 17 minutes. You can find a link to that below the video. So essentially what we have are geomagnetic excursions happening on this planet. This right here is the definitive argument ending paper. The world's best scientists in this field in the number one geophysics journal in the world. After a few decades of some scientists going back and forth about whether or not these geomagnetic excursions or these rapid pole shifts are actually that dangerous to the biosphere, to the animals living here on planet Earth. This one took a look at all of the critical data and came out with a definitive stamp saying, yeah, this is a big deal. In fact, it hits the biosphere, nearly all species in a big way and causes major uh, levels of extinction when they occur as well. The paper went over dozens and dozens of species, dozens of examples and several different instances of these magnetic excursions where we have a rapid pole shift on the planet. But the most important thing, what it all boils down to is when this happens, it is an extremely dangerous situation for all of the life living here on Earth. Now, why does this matter? This matters because right now Earth appears to be in the midst of another one. We are about a quarter of the way into it. We'll be approaching the dangerous levels in the coming years. The last one, a minor one, about 6,000 years ago, we're calling the China event. Uh, these things usually get named after a couple of years for the place where they were first discovered. This one was discovered just this last year. It hasn't had an official name yet, but it'll be something like the China event. It happened about 6,000 years ago. About 12,000 years ago, we had the Gothenburg event. This was a tremendously impactful event on the biosphere. Uh, several different species went extinct. They actually go over that in that paper. Uh, it was a bad one. We had another minor one about 18,000 years ago called Helena Pali. Lake Mungo before that, and every 6,000 years we see these things coming. And so here we sit today, 6,000 years from the last one, one of these things that is tremendously impactful in a bad way, in a negative way, for life here on the planet, exactly on time, and it is happening again. The magnetic poles are shifting and the magnetic field of our planet overall is weakening. It's the single most important thing in this entire catastrophism scenario. In all of the science of catastrophism, the fact that we are on time, right on time due for this thing that is an extinction level event causes major impact to all of the species, even though it only takes out a handful here and there in terms of complete extinction, it has major effects on all of them. We are perfectly due in time and we are seeing all of the signs that it is happening once again. So again, if you haven't seen this video, this is important. Anyway, want to make sure you guys are all caught up with that before we have the follow-up video to that, which should come out uh, in just a couple of weeks. Uh, otherwise, folks, I hope you saw this morning's show where we showed the uh, the images of Observer Ranch, <clears throat> the spring rains have come, the spring snow melt is here. It's one of two major water discharge events through the ranch. It is green as can be and it is fantastic. If you want to know more about Observer Ranch, go down and click the link to ObserverRanch.com below. So again, below, we not only have the link to Observer Ranch, we've got the link to the Earth Disaster video, which you should be watching, and we have links to both my Twitter and our e-magazine, which is the number one way you can support the observers right now. I will see you in the morning for the daily show. Be safe, everyone.